This is Lab 10. Please be sure that you have read Lab 10 in your lab manual before proceeding. This is our setup. Here is our wave generator. We'll be using this to produce waves. These waves will travel down a string that will be tied to the generator and this will go over a pulley and we'll go down to a mass which will be our source for tension. Waves reflected off of the pulley will become standing waves at certain frequencies. Please make sure that your string stretches all the way across the table and make sure that you measure the distance between the center of the pulley and the wave generator. Your settings should look like the ones here. You should have the power on and you should have a frequency range of 100 Hz and you should also have a sine wave. These knobs don't really matter except for this last knob which must be turned all the way to the right. This controls the amplitude of the waves and this should be at maximum so that you can see the waves that you are producing. Adjust the coarse tuning knob first and then adjust the fine tuning knob to get the highest accuracy. When you have it correctly adjusted, it should look something like this. This is the n equals 3 standing wave, so called because it has three antinodes, three areas with maximum vibrations, and n equals 6 and 7 can be quite difficult to see. This has been a UT Physics Lab production.